Yo, what's good, yo? You already know who it is, man. It's your boy, Humphrey J. Campbell, aka Hum Diggity Dog. Sexiest man not alive. You already know, man. Welcome to episode two of Draw With Me. I'm back with yet another spicy drawing for y'all. Today I'm drawing this gorgeous black mama man she's so fun she's mm, i saw this photo and immediately i was like yeah that's definitely what i'm drawing today now the idea i had behind this drawing was divine feminine you know i love my women man women are so wonderful bro i can't even I could just like sit here and talk about them all day but I'd rather draw them instead <laughs> so yeah the idea I had was div divine feminine and just like with divine masculine the divine feminine comes with comes in two parts the light feminine and the dark feminine the dark feminine includes all the all the nasty 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 qualities that we love from our women it's the side of a woman that's gonna tear your clothes off ride you to you <gasps> to you It's the side of her that's gonna swallow your babies with pride. You know what I'm talking about, man. It's that side of woman that we all love. But it's a side that is frowned upon by religion. Now the other side of that, religion and society in general, society tells women to be meek and you know, but that's that's the, the light feminine, the other side that religion approves of, approves of. It's the side where it's the side of a woman who where it's where she's humble, meek, follows the man's lead, you know what I'm saying? Submissive. That's the light side. Now both sides are essential to bring balance we can't demonize one and then praise the other you know what i'm saying we all want a woman who can be nice and meek wife material but who can also go wild can be a freak you know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's what we like, man. So that's the idea I wanted to go with today. And you'll see later on that I actually, when I was rendering it out, I um, I used two tones, a blue one and a red one. The red one represents the, the dark feminine, the feisty side, and the blue one, represents the the other one the other side the one that's more humble more calm you know what i'm saying so i just wanted to draw that balance you know what i'm saying so you get that yeah but i'll tell you this i had a lot of fun drawing her i'm i'm, I'm really realizing i love drawing the female body oh my fucking god it's so mm, it's so wonderful so so wonderful but who knows you know i might draw the male one as well i will draw the male one because i'm fair like that you know what i'm saying this is all f this is for my the male and female audience because this is a female appreciation drawing right here you know what i'm saying the divine feminine also while i was drawing this i actually realized i kind of have a fetish for beads now yeah waist beads so with that being said my next girlfriend has to have a waist bead you know what i'm saying no negotiation but that shit is so sexy bro i don't know what it is about the waist beads but it's just 
it just screams erotic you know what i'm saying <laughs> you know what i'm saying bro i just wanna mm, yeah Ooh. that shit is hot bro so while drawing her when i was drawing the waist beat i was like definitely my next girl has to have a waist beat no negotiation because that shit is so fucking sexy anyways with the chain that I'm drawing right now, I decided to add a little casing, you know, gotta, gotta put my symbol on there, you know, like Camel Comics, you know what I'm saying, because I'm the one who drew it, you know what I'm saying, so, so yeah, man, but, uh, all in all, bro, I had so much fun drawing this one, especially when it came to render, and I'm really, really, really happy with how it turned out, super, super, duper happy, uh, also while I was adding color I realized I didn't I forgot to add one essential part one very very important part which you will see in a few and that part is come on come on it's, it's almost there come on come on there yeah, the nipples you see that <laughs> the little nipples popping out of the bra yeah that's, that's very essential I had to draw that also I came to a decision that I'm gonna keep it PG. I'm gonna keep the draw well, draw with me on YouTube. I'm gonna keep it PG. You know what I'm saying? Because I don't wanna get banned and also my family members watch these and the last post kind of freaked them out. <laughs> so I've decided that for YouTube, I'm gonna keep it PG. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna keep it. I'm gonna draw sexy spicy stuff but i'm gonna keep it pg like with her she has she's dressed but you know she shared she's showing a fair amount of skin and then when i start the patreon on there on patreon i'm gonna be drawing i'm gonna be going full explicit you know what i'm saying full nudity dick pussy everything as you can see right now i actually added the two tones one of the right side is the red and the other one on the left side is the, the blue tonation so yeah the red for the dark feminine the blue for the light feminine because we like both of those sides we don't discriminate on here and now i'm just going over the first layer of shadow just base the base shadow you know that falls on the on the form basically and I really like when I start doing this because that's when the image really starts to sit starts to take shape really I start to see the three-dimensional form take place although it was tricky because while I was like adding the shade work I had to switch between the two tones so that like because like in the in the red side I had to use the red the darker red for the shadows in the blue side actually so it was kind of tricky at first but uh, it was fun it was really fun rendering just for real for real for real for real yeah and next i'm just adding um next layer of shadow the cast shadow the shadows that fall immediately like on the bra you know where the clothes touch the little crevices the little areas that the light would not reach at all so all in all it's like it's I'm <sighs> It's so much fun, man. Like draw, drawing is so much fun, you guys. I, have, I feel, I feel alive when I'm drawing. I feel like, uh, I feel like God. I'm creating life here, bro. I'm creating life. This is legit life I'm creating right here, bro. I'm telling a story. I'm so fucking talented. It's ridiculous, bro. I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful for all my hard work that brought me here. You know what I'm saying? But before I proceed, I gotta say that thigh is looking juicy. <laughs> that thigh is looking juicy. I could just, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Lord have mercy. <laughs> Lord have mercy. <laughs> wow. I'm a nasty nigga, man. I ain't gonna lie. But I'm proud of it. I'm not ashamed. You know what I'm saying? We should all be, we should all be proud of our darker sides you know what i'm saying i feel like a lot of us suppress our sexual urges because of 
the environments we grew in religion telling us oh sex is evil blah 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 no 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 sex is wonderful the human the human form sexy human form it's wonderful the only reason why we over sexualize nowadays is because we're so scared of seeing it you know we're so ashamed of seeing it so we're deprived of seeing it so what happens is when we do see it it's like a huge ass deal we over sexualize it as if we've never seen it before because we haven't i know i don't know don't quote me on this but i know in some in the in the in the, in the genius indigenous oh my god i cannot say that in those tribes that are still quote unquote primitive that still don't like you know those those uh, those tribes that live in islands walk around back naked like there are no cases of rape and shit like that like in modern society because then in those societies like since you were born like since we were young it's like you see each other naked like you see naked women walking around naked men walking so it's a normal thing you know what i'm saying it's just in civilized quote unquote civilized societies where we we try to hide the human form you know so it's, you know, we try to keep it or so what's the word i'm looking for man we shame it we demonize it so we hide it so what happens is when we do see it it's like it's a huge deal you know it's an over sexualization it's like we, we deprive ourselves of seeing stuff like this you know what i'm saying because it's quote unquote you know sin or whatever but i don't care bro i'm here to celebrate the human form i'm here to sell that's why i started this series bro i'm gonna be i'm gonna keep drawing this spicy spicy drawings just for that bro like that's my mission right there you know what i'm saying like just celebrate the beauty of the human form without ne- needlessly over sexualizing of course when i you know when i'm making this commentary it's entertainment so obviously i have to you know put an act but if i'm being real you know what i'm saying like this is really just to to celebrate like to you know the joy the, the, the human form it's, it's a beautiful thing we shouldn't feel guilty for wanting to appreciate it or to talk about it or to to show it off you know what i'm saying don't be afraid to show off your body you know what i'm saying be proud of what you have be proud of what you have man hey man i got nothing i got nothing more to say other than that i'll just let you guys enjoy the rest of the speed paint enjoy the music and as always Thank you for taking the time to watch and to listen to me in my ridiculousness. <laughs> I love making these as I think they're very entertaining, you know what I'm saying? So if you haven't already, be sure to subscribe, leave a like, share, leave a comment, and of course, most importantly, enjoy. Enjoy. Oh, before I go, let me just say see what I did here on the red side I added the blue background and on the blue side I had the red background just to compliment I'm so fucking smart bro. I'm so fucking crazy it's ridiculous <laughs> I enjoy the rest of the front man adding the background yeah I was just playing around with at this point bro but yeah man with that being said I'm out here peace